We are celebrating Black History Month. All month long, we'll be highlighting events, people, and places rich with African-American culture and history. Many stories will focus on the arts from culinary to theater. Well, today, the legacy of Jackie Taylor, founder of the Black Ensemble Theater. ABC 7's Terrell Brown says she's still most recognized for just two simple words. Cooley high. <laughs> Jackie's role in this classic movie will always bring her fond memories. You know, Cooley High was so much fun. It was a time in my life that that was my first film. She grew up on Chicago's north side in Cabrini Green and always knew her passion was acting. You know, I've always been theatrical. I always made up stories. I'm an actress. I will always be an actress. Uh, but right now the focus is on theater and, and making my theater uh, sustainable to last beyond Jackie Taylor. Taylor founded the Black Ensemble Theater in 1976 with one mission in mind. You know, I had experienced such racism in the film industry and in Chicago. And I said, hell no. I want to eradicate racism, wipe it out totally. And I'm going to start an organization to do it. And that was the Black Ensemble Theater. Over the last 42 years, Taylor has been an educator in CPS schools, an actress, singer, director, and a playwright with more than 100 plays and musical biographies. But it's still her first play that means the most. Oh, well, of course, my first one is going to stick out every time. And that's the other Cinderella. It's such a wonderful message of acceptance and understanding. So out of all of the plays that I've ever written, that one is my baby. And when you ask what she'd like history to say about her legacy. Isn't that, that's a question. What will the history books say? Hmm. They will say, she came, she saw, she conquered. And the Black Ensemble Theater has a new show that opens up a little bit later on this month. Hail, Hail Chuck, a tribute to Chuck Berry. We've got all the information on that, plus bonus clips from Jackie Taylor's interview. You can find all of that on our website at abc7chicago.com. I'm Terrell Brown, ABC7 Eyewitness News.